What's up everyone? I am Jamie with 3 If you're new here, welcome to my channel. If you've been around for a while, welcome back. I'm glad to see you as always. So today we are going to continue on with our soap making and I'm going to be doing some summer and some Arkansas inspired soaps. Today we are going to make one of my favorite cool treats of the summer inspired soap, creamsicle popsicles. So good. I love orange popsicles. I don't know what it is. It's just my favorite of all time. So we're going to make some a creamsicle inspired soap. So let's get started. All right, we are ready to make some soap. I've already given my oils a quick blend. I've added some kaolin clay and some goat milk powder to it. And today we are making some orange sickle inspired soap because I love orange sickles. They're probably my favorite popsicle of all time. We of course are always, like always, making some beer soap. If you've never made beer soap, I have a video dedicated to the entire process of making just beer soap. It's great for skin. I love it. It's my favorite soap to use. So that is why I make it. And as always, there will be a bunch of links in the description for beginning soap makers, why I put kale and clay in myself, just a whole bunch of useless, useful information. It's not useless, it's useful information down in the description box. So without further ado, let's get started. Oh, and I am, for my colors, I'm using Siesta Sunset Orange from Crafter's Choice. And I had a little bit of orange mica, it was a sample. I think it was from Brambleberry that I threw in there as well, just to darken it up just a teensy bit. So it looks like that. And I pre-mix my micas with oil from my batch. Just makes it a little bit easier. And then I'm also going to be using some titanium dioxide as well. So let's get soaping. I'm just going to add in my lye solution. And I'm not temperaturing it because I made this solution and these oils yesterday and they're literally at 80 degrees. It's a little bit warm in my office because I have the AC turned off right now because it's really loud. But I'm going to bring this to a very light trace. I'm actually going to add in my essential oil. I'm just using straight orange essential oil today. Nothing specialty blended or special about it. Just good old delicious smelling orange essential oil. Let me know down in the comments what your favorite essential oil smell is. I'm always been just partial to like oranges. I like like lavender I love a good fruity smelling scent. I don't know why. Alrighty. And that was just a little chunk of kale and clay that didn't get mixed in all the way that I just pulled out. No big deal. It happens. Alrighty. So I'm going to split these off. I'm probably doing a one to two ratio, maybe three to one. Yeah, three to one. We're gonna do white and the smaller, orange and the bigger. Hopefully I didn't fill that up too much so I can't get my <laughs> stick blender in because I'm putting titanium dioxide in here and it needs to be stick blended. Will adapt. Oh, jeez, I got my hair. All over. It's okay. It is okay. Alright, let's scrape this. Quick. Just to make sure it's good to go. And I think 
What am I in the mood for today? Because I don't plan these things out. Why would you plan soaping out? I don't like planning because I just like to go with the flow. And people are probably cringing right now. Go with the flow. Ugh, why would you do something like that? I'm a rebel. I, just, I want it to be just nice and swirly, you know? Because this is still pretty fluid, I'm just going to leave it a flat top and just kind of give it just a little bit of a swirl. I don't want to interfere with it too much, you know? Take my messy glove off. And I'm not even going to spritz it with rubbing alcohol yet because it's still so liquidy. I'll come back in probably 20 minutes and do that. But for you guys, I will see you when we are ready to cut. Alrighty y'all, so it is again my favorite day, soap cutting day. So we're going to cut this open and see what it looks like. It may be a little bit difficult to cut because I may have let it sit for two days, maybe three. We will, we will prevent, we will get this cut. Just gotta use some root strength. Oh, yeah. Love that sound, right? The best sound in the world. All right, let's see what she looks like. Gorgeous. Oh. You love orange. This is for you. So good. So that is what I've got. So I will see you guys in the outro. So that is what I've got for you guys today. If you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. It really helps. And if you haven't already, hit that subscribe button. What are you waiting for? We put out new videos every single week, sometimes twice a week if I'm feeling spunky. And I will see you guys next time. Bye.